Hi, this is Nate with Cloud Pano Automotive here to tell you all about how to get these interactive 360 virtual spins up on your Facebook marketplace listings. So let's dive in. First of all, we have the virtual spin with Cloud Pano Automotive. You can create these and automatically integrate with your website and use the URL based output to paste anywhere else on any vehicle listing description. So what is the spin? We have the exterior view. You are able to put hotspots and info spots on it as well as a lead generation form that can go directly to uh, your CRM. And you have the ability to put logos uh, in the upper corner and then put any kind of vehicle description you want. I put the price, the phone number, email address, and then just a description of the vehicle itself up here as well. Um, you can put anything you want into those text fields though. Um, we do have the ability to do live video chat as well. So if you wanted to uh, log in as a guest and uh, hop into a live video chat, uh, you do have the capability of doing that. Hello, there I am. So um, these are also available in virtual reality. So if you had a mobile VR headset uh, like a Google Cardboard or something like that, you could put your phone into the headset and view in virtual reality. These links are shareable, clickable, um, all that kind of fun stuff. So how do we get it into uh, the Cloud Pano, uh, how do we get Cloud Pano into the Facebook Marketplace listing? Well, let's check it out. When going to Facebook Marketplace, you can choose create a new listing, which is down here, and then you can select vehicle for sale. It's gonna give you a little mock-up page here and what you're gonna do is enter in your vehicle type, all those things. What I wanna show you though is where this goes. So you can copy the, the uh, URL from there or you can grab it from here by clicking. And then the place that you're gonna put this is in the top line of the description. View this vehicle in 360 degrees. If you don't know how to do the degree symbol, it's a shift, alt, and then the number eight. Um, and then you would paste that link there. And I like to sometimes uh, just put some asterisks here so that people know that this is a special thing. Make sure to put a space between the end of the URL and any additional asterisks that you want to put in there. Just so people know this is a special thing you need to look at. Um, look right here. Click this link. And they're not actually going to be able to click it, but it will be viewed if they want to. This is how the, uh, the, end, the end result of the listing looks, and this is where you can see that link. All they have to do is highlight. There we go. We can highlight this, copy, go to a tab, paste it, and there we are. You're all ready. Once they're here, they can go inside of the vehicle, they can look around, they can click on going into the back seat, they can truly see a good representation of what this vehicle looks like and what it's like to be on the inside and the outside. So they can, you can put all kinds of engagement elements here. I would recommend put as many clickable elements as possible. That will increase the level of engagement that that buyer has when they're looking at your vehicle. I actually sold this van to a person in a neighboring suburb by utilizing this 360 technology. When we actually met in person to exchange the van, there were no additional questions that needed to be asked because I had put all the information like mileage and on the outside of the vehicle, I put uh, any kind of updates or repairs that had been done, all those kinds of things, any blemishes I put, there's a crack in the corner of the windshield, timing belt replaced, all those things. I put into this virtual spin to where when they actually bought the vehicle, there were no questions that needed to be asked. It broke down the trust barrier that is present in online selling of cars to where it was non-existent. We were able to quickly exchange the vehicle, get the payment processed, all those sorts of things, and there was no surprises on the side of the buyer. You know, I put everything I could into what this is so that they would not be surprised when they went to look at this vehicle. Um, notice I've also got all the detail images down here that I took. Um, I did all of this with a mobile device and the Cloud Panel Automotive app. 
um, which you can get access to um, if you uh, get a hold of our, our team. So um, super easy to use, super quick to use, um, and you have the ability to do all the things that you normally do uh, for automotive listings. But here it is on Facebook Marketplace. I sold this van and I actually sold it. You can see here it's priced a little high for what this is. I, I came down a, a little bit on this price, but I still sold it above this Kelly Blue Book value. That is fairly consistent to what we're seeing on dealership websites and auction sites when there is a range of value for a vehicle. If it has a 360 on it, it's selling for the high range. So if you want your top margin for the vehicle you're selling, get Cloud Pano Automotive 360 Interactive Spin today. Thanks for watching.